Holy shit, is that, is that some sort of miniature town? Oh, hello there. <laughs> I'm Cutie Hubie, and it's my great pleasure to introduce you to Little Cutie Town. <laughs> We're a nice, peaceful society full of cute little one-inch tall guys who love each other and only know how to be nice. We welcome all strangers with open arms and a full heart. I'm so, so glad you found your way to our sweet little slice of heaven. Please, we all hope you enjoy your time here. Go on, step inside. Trust me, friend, you'll have the time of your life here in Little Cutie Town. Just head on down the main strip there towards downtown and take in all the cute little sights. We have a live with Oh, fantastic! You've decided to take a look around Little Cutie Town. Oh, I'm so excited for you to see everything Little Cutie Town has to offer. Oh my god! Oh no, 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 you're destroying everything! Oh no, you just ah, That was a power plant, a nuclear power plant! Totally safe, by the way, you're going to get rid of it! Oh, you're destroying our historic monuments! Oh my god, that's little Cutie Town Hall! That's where our founding fathers signed the original peace treaty that- Okay, that's it, that's my whole- my whole town! My whole little Cutie Town's ruined! You've ruined the whole city and all my friends are dead! I'm the only last little cutie alive and I am going to kill myself, I guarantee! It. As soon as you walk away, I'm gonna be so depressed I just pop a gun in my own head and I die. I'm just gonna fucking die. How's that sound? No more living for me. I don't want to be alive. My whole town and home is gone and dead and you did it. It's your fault. I know I invited you in, but you should have realized you're so big. You're gonna ruin things. You should have told me. I didn't think about it. I'm kind of dumb sometimes, but you're you're not as dumb as me, I, I assume. So you should have said, hey, I'm not gonna go in there. I don't want to stomp on shit like a big Godzilla. Not for me. Not, my, not what I want to do with my life. I don't want to go kill everybody. That's what you should have said. Instead, you just did it. You walked in and you knocked over entire buildings. Everyone's dead now. I am, I am so sad. I'm so fucking sad right now. I know that I, I mostly I'm just yelling. But if you, if you let me just calm down for a second, which I'm gonna do. Okay, I'm gonna calm down right now. I am so fucking sad. I'm so fucking depressed now. Do you have a, can, just shoot me. Shoot me with your gun. Go ahead and shoot me so I die, so I don't have to kill myself. Just do me that favor. Just take me out of my misery. I don't want to be, I don't want to be alive if everyone else I know is dead. This is survivor's guilt. You ever hear that when somebody goes to fight in a war and all the friends die and then they come back they're like, why me? Why did I live? I, I, I should have died. Why me instead of them? Well, guess what, pal? That's what I'm feeling right now. And I don't have the money to spend on any more therapy. So just pop, pop me in the head. Go ahead. Just squish my head like a grape with your gun. Please, just pop, pop me. Come on, I want to die. I want to die. Come on. Come on, do it. Do it. Shoot me. I'm totally ready to go. I can't, what am I going to do? Just hang out here in the broken city? I'm going to hold my friend's corpses and say, Oh, I miss you. I love you so much and now you're dead. No, I'm not going to fucking do that. I just want to die. Come on. Come on, kill me. Come on, do it. Oh, Jesus! I wasn't sure if you were gonna actually kill him. Poor guy. You know, maybe it was the right thing to do. All right, a big desert adventure. You know, it's a bounty hunter's way. You know, how, how are you liking it? 